<laughs> Why not do a hot tub stream? I'm dead. Bro, I'm not, I don't have my summer bod yet, all right? <laughs> my mom really tossed all my clean clothes to the floor. That's jokes, man. Sorry guys, I'm just making sure that everything is sorted out. I wonder if I can play this game with um, a GameCube controller. <laughs> oh yeah, I did do a full video. So let's do this. Okay. And the 28 steps, no Rukia. Damn, dude. Why'd you do so many steps, dude? Okay, I need to find a way to make this play. Oh, okay. It, it is it, it is playing. It's just there's no music on this. Okay. The title of this be be of the op week. <clears throat> oh come on. You know I had to do something like sus, right? Is the audio good? Uh select like the language. I'll pick English. Now, I've, I'm not gonna lie, full disclosure, I've already beat this game, but I wanted to start over, because there's a lot of people who don't understand the point of Pokemon Snap, and since I know that it's before, like, everyone's freaking time, I want people to, like, enjoy the game. How do I... How do I raise it without... Raising it on. Oh, that's right. Okay, cool. Let's do this. I thought you were playing Call of Duty SMD. I'm weak. Search and destroy. Yo, what's the hype about this game? I, I love this game. This game is so cute. So, the whole point of this game, a lot of people think that it's just like, oh, it's like you just take pictures, but there's, there's a lot more to it uh, that, like, some people really. that most people don't even know about just because. Realistically speaking, not many people know game audio is loud. Mm -hmm. Fuck, I can't even hear it, dude. Go play BBS. Yeah, so. So you guys can hear that just fine, and I just can't. Why is it that you guys can hear it, but I'm not allowed to hear it? This is not fair. Let me see if I can do something. Uh, properties. Capture audio only. No, that's fine. <clears throat> Fuel just got now home with sealed Pokemon Snap. Got her 50 bucks at Walmart. Nice! Congrats. That's actually pretty dope. Okay, I'm trying to think of how to make it. Hmm. But Appreciate the follow, my boy. That's my first time here, by the way. I love your BBS content. It really helped through the years. Oh, I'm happy to help, bro. Uh, welcome to the stream. Well, as long as the audio for you guys is okay, I'm, I'm kind of sad because, like, I don't have anyone. Yeah. I can barely hear it. Let me see if I can. Is this the loud as it goes no. for me? I got an idea. Give me one second. If I click here, and then I click... Oh, volume mixer. Now, can I bring this over here? I can bring this over here. I can. Very good. Click here. 
Wow. Now if I mute it. Okay. If I mute this. All right. Can y'all hear it okay? No more YouTube stream? Did my YouTube stream die? <laughs> German double C go shh. Chill, chill. No spoilers, all right? All right, I like this stream, guys. Yo, what's going on, man? Appreciate y'all coming through. Sup, Spy, how are you? I'm good, man. Just keeping busy. By the way. YouTube's up? Okay, good. At night, you might even get to see glowing Pokemon. They're really what? pretty. So the whole point of Pokemon Snap is pretty much just to take pictures. However, there's like a lot of stuff that you can do in order to manipulate um, the circumstances in which uh, you can take pictures, which you'll see as I play the game. Now, I have played this game before, so I'm not gonna be like completely surprised. There are some things that I haven't done that uh, we'll try to do on stream, and I don't wanna look it up anymore. Oh, damn, that was actually super loud. <laughs> I'm gonna lower that a bit. Can you guys hear it okay? Like, is the audio good? Professor. Am I planning to play near Replicant? Yeah. No. I, I, I'll pick it up later. I just can't... I can't just afford to, like, needlessly spend money right now. Because I have to take into account... Um, Mid-month is literally in, like, five days. Mid-month comes out on the 16th. We should get news uh, tomorrow night. Try getting a shot of that Pokemon. Yes! <laughs> now, why don't you try move... See if you give it a... You can point the camera up and down and even spin all the way around left or right. You can use motion controls to aim your camera Fuck too. That. Motion controls is so bad. Oh, look! Here comes Pikachu. Try getting a All right. First. Did you see that shape? Whatever. It'll be try That's it. Right. We're gonna try to get the hell out of uh, the tutorial as fast as possible. Yeah, a uh, near rep, a uh, near automata is probably my favorite game of all time. Uh, do you battle? Um, no, but you. I, I don't. I don't want to spoil nothing in this game. I, I'll, I'll let y'all experience it with me, and I hope y'all enjoy it as much as I did. Okay. I'm gonna change the layout of the controllers for sure. What's up, Joe? How you doing, bro? First of all, Pokemon didn't age that well for me. I find the concept whack. I enjoyed the freak out of this. I enjoyed the freak out of this. I I, I like this game a lot. Is it worth buying? Um, to be honest, probably no. There's there's a good bit of replayability, to be honest, but there's not really. I wouldn't really recommend people buy it for 60 bucks. If it goes on sale for like maybe 50 bucks, 40 bucks, then I'd say maybe pick it up if you're like a, a, a fan of Pokemon. Yeah, but the old Pokemon Snap, you gotta understand, that came out literally a year after Pokemon came out. Like that came out in 1999. That's what, 20? Literally 22 years ago. <laughs> That's an old ass game. Like this game is going on sale. I don't know if it's going to go on sale soon, but I don't doubt that it will eventually go on sale. Alright, where is... I just wish the tutorial was a bit quicker. By the way, Though I do understand why they have it. So pretty much in order so that you don't get your fucking cheeks clapped by some Mewtwo that's interested in your asshole, uh, you have this uh, thing called the Neo 1 which is supposed to protect you. Which to this day, I'm surprised that, like, you don't get fucking electrocuted or something. Should I go up to step 10 on 1000 year blood banner? I'm already on step 5. I would do step 5 and I would stop, to be honest. <sighs> Mid-month is gonna be an easy skip, hopefully, and then on top of that, we have end of the month to look forward to. Oh, this looks so much better on the TV. <laughs> like, I, I'm, I was playing on, um, handheld mode. Okay, so first and foremost, we're gonna change this. Uh, turn off motion controls. Often? What's this? Adjust the frequency of communication. Uh, 
Rarely controller vibration off so that my controllers don't die because I don't really have much. Uh, what do you call it? Let's do eight. Uh, left stick controls, regular zoom mode, hold, frame guide. What is this? Mm, I don't need that. Buttons. Pretty sure that's the settings that I like. Uh, sound. The Florio Nature Park. So pretty much you want to get the Pokemon in frame. Can't wait to start unlocking actual stuff. They look so cute. Oh my god, Pichu's adorable. I don't have this game, but I can get it for 49. 49 is not bad. As long as you're not using like a coupon, that's uh, what do you call it? Like 10 bucks. <laughs> But if it does go on sale, I would definitely recommend people pick it up. Uh, we're gonna drive down that part, so I'll just take the pictures there. Oh, right, I forgot about the stupid little Emolgas, bro. Oh my- there's another one. I'm just gonna take a picture now. There's a big doof. The Emolga. Oh shit, he just threw himself. Oh, nice, I got- I actually got that. Cool. This is your first time? This is not my first time. I've already beaten this game, which is really why I'm kind- I'm, I'm kind of sad about it, but like, you guys gotta understand, I, I had two weeks with like, really garbage internet, and I had this game already like, downloading while, um... So I- I, I couldn't wait to play. There's no way, bro. I. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for a second I thought that was a swallow, and I'm like, wait, what? See that magic carp over there? Okay, so we can get the bidoof. The bidoof. Now, what I love about this game is they actually have several different levels for the level. So, like for example, this is the first level. However, the more points you get on the stage, the more you it levels up, and the more um. The more you level up, the more shit goes on, which is really cool. So like the stages pretty much just like evolve. Oh, look at the look at the little bidoofs. Come here, little HM sluts. There's a hoot hoot that knocks out over here. Oh, this one is a cool. N64 where you can find Mew, that was childhood. <laughs> oh, friends, you, you just just wait, bro. I'm gonna I'm try to do everything that I need to this stream so that people get a little bit, like, hype. But, like, the nostalgia factor, bro, they, they did a really good job at bringing it back, dude. They did a really good job. I'm, I'm yeah. How do you beat it? Uh, well, I mean, I guess not really beat it, but, um, like, doing all the stages, I suppose. I, I don't want to spoil nothing. At all, like I don't want to. I don't even want to give like hints of ever anything I, aside from like I do want to say like if you played the original game and you really like the original game, then I, I feel like you would definitely enjoy this because like just seeing what they did with it, like like just look at how the Pokemon look, bro. Look at the Florges, bro. Tell me you want to pipe the shit out of this green bitch. Wait, she waves? I didn't know that she waves. I did not know that she waves. This is what Kayla fuck up does to me. Yo, big facts, bro. You wanna want to fuck a flower? Should I get this on the Nintendo or 64? I'm dead. This is only on the Switch. We're talking about the Pokemon Snap on the Nintendo 64. I, I, I would not play that game. <laughs> <laughs> that game does not hold up at all. I was watching it and I'm like, yo, this game is doo-doo, bro. When it came out, though, when it came out, it was definitely very, very, very good. So what's cool is they have an auto feature, so they actually choose whatever um, the, the whatever the best rarity photo is if it's new. Okay, but, okay what they do is first they'll go by pose and by the rarest new pose so for example since this is the same pose of the Vivillion, 
it'll go with the this photo since I didn't take a two star, three star, four star version. There's four different poses of each Pokemon at least that get graded as such. The rarer the pose, the um, more stars you get on it. Which you'll see for the Florges, for example. So this is Grookey. A new discovery. Since the Grookey picture isn't like super up close, it's probably gonna be a silver. Oh, nice and gold. That's actually pretty good. Might I did a better job with Pokemon on their first time compared to Game Freak the last 10 years. You're not wrong. <laughs> Unfortunately, you're not wrong. I feel like this is a good photo of the Dodrio. Perfect. That's good. So that's a platinum photo of the one star version. And as you see here, the rarer the pose, the more stars. And all those, like the one star, two star, three star, four star, the points that you get per um, thing, they get added up together. And then that will end up being your overall score for the run. This is actually a really good picture for the logo, but it'll probably be. I don't know if it'll be bad or good. Let me see. Gold. That's actually. I'll take that. This is the better. This is a, it's a. That's the best picture I've ever taken of that logo, by the way. My 15 day do old account. <laughs> Daddy Ichigo, Mommy Ruki, Atoki, Kusaka Cook. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? Good for you, bro. That's a superior. That's a superior good head start. The Gen 5 low-key goat. I don't know what Gen 5 is, unfortunately. Great timing. I love Diamond and Pearl, Silver Gold. I loved Red and Blue. Silver Gold is goaded. I, I, no, nothing beats Silver Gold. What that did to Pokemon was absolutely insane. Because when Ruby and Gold, Ruby and Sapphire came out, it was nothing compared to like Silver and Gold. Like Silver and Gold, you had 16 badges, bro. Like, you can fight Ash, bro. Like, ugh, oh, it's so good. Can you encounter shiny Pokemon? Nah, this game doesn't work like that. Unfortunately, I wish, Mike. I I, I was hoping so, low-key. Like, maybe like a 1 in 5,000 chance that a Pokemon would be shiny and then it's like cool and all that, but... Nah. Black and White 2 is top 3 of all time. Really? Yeah, Black... See, I played Black and White. Because my brother picked it up for me, and I, I, I just lost interest after like the first two badges. And then he- <laughs> I feel so bad. And then my brother bought me uh, Black 2, or White 2, I forget which one it was. And I didn't get into it because I wasn't interested in Black and White to begin with, so I thought it was just a sequel. Feels bad. Alright, yo, take care, have a good one. Alright, let, uh, let me go through these. A new discovery. Nice work. Come fame. A new discovery. You gotta wait a couple nice of five, jeez. Now it's a sun and moon in the new gen. I feel that. Did you play Crystal? Yeah, I loved Crystal. How was it? I had to I had to like steal it though. Because anyway. uh we were poor. <laughs> mm -hmm. oh. And my dad couldn't justify getting another version of silver version. Just because the Pokemon moved. Ah right. <laughs> oh, dude. Crystal was dope. Uh, no, I don't want to save any of these. Let's uh, continue. Okay, so we leveled up to level two. So when you go to do level two, you'll see that they actually change um, the scenarios and stuff. Have you got any good pulls in Pokemon Snap? For good pulls, I'm dead. I I deleted my save, even though there were a lot of photos that I really loved. But I wanted y'all to like see it from the start. Anyway, got. Do we unlock the apples right away, or...? Look here... Huh. Now. <coughs> oh, right, they do scans, okay. So. Yeah. Yep. so pretty much what the scans do is it lets you scan the area for Pokémon, and it also allows you to, um... Uh, it, it also pretty much tells the people to do a heads up, do a summon. What's up, Jay? Should I get it or should I wait? Um, it's, it's up to you. I, if you played the original, this is definitely like a huge step up, and you probably, you definitely won't regret buying it if you're good on money. If you're like broke, you shouldn't buy any game. <laughs> Black and white was mid agreed. Feels bad. It's a sequel, but Game Freak went all out. They were at their peak but went to shit because of the lack of sales feels bad dude. 
That's actually super sad. First of all. Yeah, they have a little informs here too. Okay. So fortunately I remember how to play this game. Well, fortunately I've got I know how to play this game, so leveling up should actually be come pretty easily now in comparison to before. Can someone explain that to me, please? Why did Ash stay as a kid? Well, Ash stayed as a kid because Caleb sucks, bro. This pavilion's gonna mess up my <laughs> my pictures. What pisses me off is like, there's like a thousand like, to three thousand episodes of Pokemon and like, in neither of them Ash ages at all. Take a picture of the tail over here. That magic card jump is kind of bad. That Pichu is so fucking cute, bro. Look at the. Oh my god, I just want to teach you surf, bro. I'm gonna teach his ass strength, surf, flash, and die. Ash stuck forever 10, yo, big facts, bro. I got a Hollow Zangetsu. Hollow Zangetsu? What the hell is that? I don't even know what the front of the where the cum phase are. As for legendaries, uh, I don't want to spoil nothing. But I guess that kind of confirms it. Yo, what up, sexy? You gonna flash them titties at me or what? You see that Hall of Fame butt? Mmm. Why do we get the ticket? Um, it's for the Discord rewards. Since we got enough Discord messages or people to join, yeah. Then we get a five star ticket. But keep in mind that, that that's a five star ticket. It's not like a here's an event ticket. So that ticket's gonna update with time. I'm personally gonna hold mine until anniversary. Cause if it's gonna update, potential chance you get the sixth anniversary character. Super, super rare, slim chance. But like, since I already have everything in the premium pool that I could possibly want, right. I don't, I have no problem waiting a little bit. Nice work. I'll probably get a fucking like, doo doo Pokemon, Pokemon five star from it, but whatever. Oh, it's actually nice a platinum. Let's go. Nice work. LG mind keeping, right? 
I can't think of any anything I want in the premium pool. Nice work. Which is, I, I suppose, a good thing. Now, the money I had is just, do I want to waste it on a game? Oh, I feel that. Well, I mean, I mean, I mean, like that's the thing, right? And I, and I tell people that all the time. It's like it has, nothing, it has nothing to do about having the money or not. Like, like I have the I have the money. If I want to buy a Corvette, I can get a fucking fifty thousand dollar Corvette. But am I willing to put myself in a bad financial position for a fucking car that's gonna depreciate in value? Probably not. You know. Uh, the, I, I tell people all the time, it's like, there's a difference between, like, affording and affording. Because it's like, yeah, sure, you might be able to buy it, but, like, if you're not gonna uh, disfrute that, if you're not gonna, like, fully enjoy it, it's like, it's like you probably shouldn't spend the money on it. Yeah, hopefully they give us the apple. Nice. So if you score well enough or level up and stuff like that, usually they'll actually, um, let you progress. The only professors I know are Oak and Birch. Hello. Oak, Birch... Anyway. I'm trying to remember the other ones. How many times you play the old gens? I probably beat the original red version like three times. Um, silver like probably twice. N not counting the remakes, right? Uh, Fire Red I beat it once, and they had so much extra end game content, which was dope. Same with Soul Silver. Ruby I beat once. I didn't particularly like the the thing because they they also came out with Emerald, so I played Emerald. I played Crystal. Um. I loved Pearl. Diamond and Pearl was dope. X and Y, I loved X and Y. X and Y was great. Yo, the score buddy is so funny, bro. He's like, yo, watch me dab on him, bro. Where's the bidoof? Emerald was the shits. Emerald is fucking crazy. And then they did the em the new Emerald version. Wait, hold up. They didn't remake Emerald, right? Yeah, so you see, like, during nighttime, you have, like, a whole different amount of Pokemon and stuff. We have Torterra's now. Looking forward to Brilliant Diamond. Aw, oh, dude. The fact that they're remaking them is crazy. Woke the little. Oh, this dude fucking flew away. I'm done, bro. Personally, I like Palkia more than Dialga. 
Um, I think Dialga's cooler. But, like, um... Since I got Pearl and my brother got Diamond... Because we take we used to take turns picking which one we wanted, and then eventually it got to the point where Pokemon comes out around my birthday, so my brother would always message me. He's like, "I mean, don't buy the new Pokemon game. I'm buying it for you." I'm like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> Look at the crystal blooms, bro. Oh, these are awake. Well, that's a pretty good picture of Combi. Hey, do you copy? We just picked up a huge energy reading near you. The professor's busy trying to make sense of the data. Let's ask him about it when you get back. Okay. Oh, I love how cute these things look. Who's this cute streamer? I'm dead, bro. They only remade Sapphire and Ruby. Yeah, I was sad, because, like... They could, they, oh, I feel like if they remade Emerald, they would have gotten a crap ton of sales, too. And then again, I guess they'd have to, like, change stuff. It looks weird to me. Palkia is literally just a PP. <laughs> I'm dead. I've never seen someone called Palkia a penis, bro. Like, <laughs> what? Have you got any good pulls? Uh, let me see. Uh, get whichever one you want, because we can all trade when Spike streams it. Oh yeah, that's true too. Yeah, that's true too. I'll, I'll definitely be streaming. Cause it's gonna be on the Switch. Ah, oh, the fact that it's gonna be on the Switch is gonna be so dope. Uh, yo, the Switch I still think is the best console. Anyone who says that it's like PS5 or Xbox is a moron. Literally almost every one of those games is gonna be coming on the PC. And Emerald Remake would be nuts. Yeah, I usually stream Pokemon when it comes out. I still need to do the freaking um, DLC I paid for. I never, never freaking played it. But I played a little bit of it. I streamed a little bit of it, but I never actually did the other, the cool stuff. But I didn't stream. I didn't stream the dungeon branching paths. My first legendary was a freaking shiny Xerneas. So I was like, damn, that's cool. I was really happy with that. A new discovery. They made an Emerald remake, it's called Aorus. Oh, that, that's fair. Because it is the story. I personally have the 3DS more, but I feel you like playing Pokemon on my P TV. Oh, no, I mean in general, I love the Switch. Like, being able to just put it and put it onto the TV, being able to just put it onto the TV, put it, take it out on the fly, play it on your, like, as a mobile device is so cool. And knowing that it just lowers the resolution, you still play in the game and all that, is freaking awesome. Mm. You know, you can play this on PC, I don't know about... Oh, with the emulator? Man... I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna play it on an emulator, I really do want to support the... I really want to support this type of game. Really, I, w I was off by literally a thousand points. I could've took a picture of Dodrio's butt out, like, butthole. That's what we did with Sword and Shield. Yep, yep. That's <sighs> Something incredible has happened. Here, take a look at this. What is that? Here's the thing. When you got near the field of flowers, I picked up an incredibly strong energy reading. Mm -hmm. Alright, so pretty much we're gonna go, um, I'll research the Illumina Pokemon. I don't know if we're gonna... Did I unlock it already? Click, click. Oh, we already have the Illumina spot. Wow, okay. Moon was nice, so many legendaries. Dude, any anything that actually has a storyline with the legendaries involved is cool. Like I'm I I miss where the reading was coming from. I miss like the the shaman storyline and the dark rye and the Cresselia. Like having storylines and stuff like that was so cool. The Arceus storyline that was locked. 
But, like, I, I didn't like that it was locked behind, like, freaking action replay if you couldn't drive around. Like, imagine how, like, stupid you would sound as, like, a 10-year-old. Mom, we have to drive four hours to the nearest Pokemon store so that I can get a Pokemon in my game. Your mom, your, my dad slapped me, bro. He's like, yeah. no habla estupidez, ese man. Like, don't, don't speak stupidity. Like, what the hell's wrong with you? Imagine you, imagine you buy like a fucking. Quick, get it fixed. Imagine you go to Subway, you ask for a sandwich, and then they tell you, okay, um, if you if you want the meat though, you're gonna have to go across the street. Okay. Look how fucking massive this fucking meganium is, like. I don't know if it's here. In the later stages, like, there's more Pokemon than just the Meganium. The Meganium ate too many Caterpies. <laughs> Oh, that's a cute picture, though. And so those, like, the Illumina, the Crystal Blooms, uh, cause them to actually shine even more. Despite my wholesome boy. What's up, Ash Nage? How you doing? Bro, I remember playing Pokemon Stadium on the N64. Yo, Pokemon Stadium was like the craziest thing, cause like that was a, uh, that was like when Pokemon Stadium 2 came out, that was like the best game in the world. Cause like you could transfer your characters from Pokemon Red and Blue into those games, and they were all holding items, and I'm like, I'm like, my Charizard was a male the whole time. That's so cool. Oh, my Squirtle was a female. Oh, they were holding Rost Berries and shit. And I'm just like, that was a really cute touch. So if you transfer the Pokemon from red and blue to, uh, uh, if you transfer the Pokemon from red and blue All right. to Pokemon Stadium 2, you could transfer them to Pokemon Stadium. Uh, you can put them back into silver and gold and they would have like all these items and stuff like that, which is really cool. And of course they didn't let you put silver and gold Pokemon into your red and blue, which I tried because I was, I was a kid, all right? I was, I, was, I was a kid and I was hoping for the best. I'm like, imagine I put Typhlosion in my red version. I didn't know what coding was and all that back then, all right? I just assumed that everything worked. <laughs> Um, pretty much the story of Pokemon Snap is really, I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty dog shit. Uh, pretty much you, you see a lot of energy reading, so you take pictures of Pokemon, and then you give, like, the research and stuff like that to this professor, and hopefully he doesn't actually try to mastermind and kidnap whoever, uh, is the final Pokemon that's causing the spikes of energy or whatever. First starter, Charmander. Easy Charmander. You're back! It was between Charmander and Squirtle, because the problem with Venusaur is he looked super ugly. Like, all the Pokemon looked pretty ugly back in the day. Like, the sprites were horrible. Mm -hmm. To be honest, I always thought Firo was like this big fucking demonic bird. Like, let, let, me, let me see if I can pull up, um... I, I, I'm pretty sure I've said this before, too. Okay, so if I type in... Oh, oops, I have to pull this. Give me one second. So if I type in Firo Red Version, okay. Yeah, so this was Firo, right? Uh, open image in new tab. Sorry, I'm late. Okay. 
So when I was a kid, you see, this is Firo's head right here. But like, that's not what I used to see. When, when I when I saw Firo for the first time, bro, I thought it was a demon. I thought this was the eye. I thought this was the mouth. And I thought this was like, a, kind of like a mohawk. And then this was like the feather. So I thought it was kind of like a halucha. Uh, to be honest, like it really looked like a fucking halucha, I suppose. I mean, we, I didn't know what a halucha was back then. So I thought this was the feet, this was the hand, um, this was the eye, and like we, all, it, the the screens were like tiny, right? So you couldn't like like imagine if this was like zoomed out even more. Like this is what we saw. So you can't really make out the head here. This looked like the obvious head, and then you also had like the demonic Pokemon, right? So you also had like freaking Venusaur. I can't even read what I'm typing. Uh, Venusaur. I'm trying to see. Ah, oh, dude, yeah, when they had this, this was like Leaf Green and Fire Red. Yeah, they, they, they made him look so cool. Yeah, th this was what the what the Venusaur looked like, but there was it was only black and white because we didn't have color back then. Uh, let me see. Click here. Oh, there it is. Perfect. Literally perfect. Okay. Let's not get banned for that. Okay, so that's what Blastoise looked like. Blastoise literally looked like a fat, like... He, he literally looked like Notorious B.I.G. And then Charizard looked kind of cool. But he didn't look like he does now, right? Like, he kind of, like, has, like, a little fatter face. Kind of like a Dragonair. Um, but Venusaur just looked, didn't look cool at all. Venusaur literally looked like a overweight, obese cat with like a flower on his back. So yeah, I just, I just really wasn't interested in anything to do with, Bulbasaur was cute and eventually it got to the point where me and my brother would trade, oh. but yeah, for Fire Red it was Bulbasaur. Yeah, I, I feel like they did a good job with how Pokemon looks like now. Is there any mention of Todd in this game? Yo, Dark. All right. <laughs> uh, you, you'll find out soon. <laughs> I, I, I guess that's kind of a Morning. spoiler. Here's the thing. Huh? But really? <laughs> Jeez. But <laughs> right. Onyx's sprite huh? image in yellow was a downgrade from how it was in red and blue. Yeah, I mean they had both, right? Like. Some of them, most of them were better, but there were, I mean, there's gonna be some hit or miss sometimes, so. He was Chubby Zard. He, 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 man, he, he cool, he cool. Forget out the Reggie's on my own when I was little. We just so happened to have the Lewis Braille book in my book collection with the alpha. That's, aw, oh, dude, that's actually dope. I mean, we had the, we, we were just starting to learn how to Google. I remember I used to print out pages of like cheat codes and stuff and how to duplicate. You remember how to duplicate? I don't know for those that played silver, but there was a way to duplicate character Pokemon using um the PC. But like you had to lose, you had to sacrifice a Pokemon to duplicate it. And eventually, I found out the mechanics of the glitch to the point where I was able to duplicate without sacrificing any Pokemon to begin with. And what's funny is the first time that I ever duplicated a Pokemon, I accidentally duplicated over my main starter. And since it saves when you restart the game. I lost my main starter, and I cried, bro. I was literally crying because I lost my Typhlosion. And I'm, I, I literally cried, and I ran to my dad, and I'm like, these cheat codes don't work, and I got screwed. They took away my best Pokemon. <laughs> I was so sad. <laughs> uh, dude. Yeah, I was so sad, bro. I re had to restart my game because I'm not going to play without my Typhlosion. Had to restart when I was already at, like, level 36. Fucking depressed, man. <laughs> I got the same shirt as mine. This one? This is Costco, bro. Costco is dope. I'm gonna skip the tutorials. Pretty easy. It took me so long to play Pokemon, my mom thought they were demonic. Yo, my parents thought that they were demonic, too. Nah, that's because, like, the church... It, it, it was a super... It, it was a fucking... 
It was a pandemic, bro. It was worse than coronavirus for kids, dude. Like, my parents threw out even, like, my fucking Spider-Man movies. Anything that had enough- anything that was, like, a changing a human at all, or- and monsters, Pokemon, everything was demonic. Everything summoning demons, doing this, doing that. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? And, and it's so funny, because, like, my dad was, like, the nicest person, because he, he agreed with my mom. So he would come to our rooms and take away our Pokemon games, but he would hide them on top of his TV, where we knew that we would find them. And me and my brother thought we were so smart, and we're like, wow, my dad's so dumb, he, he don't even know that we just take the games back after he takes them away. Bro, my dad could've just tossed them in the trash, and then we would've never found them ever again. But, like, he held them because he knew that we actually enjoyed playing those games, so... Yeah, my, my dad's a sweetheart. I, I, it was so funny, because, like, in retrospect, I think back and I'm like, wow, I was literally retarded thinking that my dad was dumb. Like, he knew exactly what he was doing. I'll probably do the same thing to my kid. If I don't, if I don't believe that it's, like, they're doing something too bad, because I don't think a video game would be anywhere near... It, like, like, if it's, like, weed or something like that, obviously I'll, like, toss it out, because I don't want, like, my kids, especially when they're little youngins, to be doing that. But, like, if it's not, like, a crazy big deal, like, I'll probably do the same thing. And it's kind of like playing a game. They just say words at most, yeah. Uh, let me see. So you can actually toss this at <laughs> you can actually toss it at people. Are you gonna smoke in front of Michelle Dominus? Nah, I'm not a I'm not a smoker. I'm not interested in that. No offense to anyone who's interested in smoking and like smoking, but it's just not for me. Oh, I goofed it. I was hoping to get a good picture of that. All oh, right, it's level three. I forgot this came out. Yo, Justin, I appreciate the fight out, don't know, baby. Thank you, thank you. Look at the little worm pull. Yeah, I've been waiting for this game to come out. As soon as I heard it was a thing, I pre-ordered it and everything. I <laughs> just, just fucking domoed the poor little ducklet, like... Damn, I missed that pick so bad. I hit the Pichu. <laughs> that PJ looks like it has diarrhea, bro. Oh, look at the freaking. Mm. Bro, even the Bidoof looks adorbs. That's. Oh, I've never seen them holding the. Okay, will you drop this? Drop it. <laughs> That's right. You almost killed that duck. I'm just giving him a little bit of a concussion, you know? You know what I never understood about Pokemon? Wouldn't you be able to, um... Wouldn't you be able to, like, just toss the Pokeball super hard and just break their brain? Like, what's keeping you from, like, chucking the living shit out of a Pokeball and giving them, a, like, brain damage? And then just taking them in the Pokemon Center, you know? Like, they're like, oh, you need a Pokemon to, like, capture Pokemon. No, you don't. Like, if it's a Caterpie, bro, and he, he he knocks out my Pikachu or some somehow, some way, I punch the shit out of that Caterpie. I kick that motherfucker. And then I'll take my Pokeball, and then I'll smash it on its head until it stays in there. So I, I never understood why you're not allowed to just be like, oh, okay. You know, like, like why, why can't I just keep... Why can't I capture this Pokemon? Like, you remember how, like, Ash was, like, trying to capture the Spearows and shit? Or the- how we called the Pidgey, for example. Wow, they're so cute. They are so- Fucking cute! 
Yeah, that Pichu's coming home. Bro, that Pokemon just standing there menacing like that. Uh, they us though not allow me and my brothers from watching Dragon Ball Z. Oh, they used to not allow. Bro, they didn't let me watch shit, dude. And and you know what happens if you don't let your kid watch something like that actually isn't that bad. They find something that's much worse. So like me and my brother were watching like Dragon Ball Z. We were watching fucking South Park. We were watching everything that was really, really, really not good. You know what I'm saying? Bro, I was watching porno at the age of like fucking 11 years old. Because like, if I can't watch anything, I start searching through the channels and I found channel 82 and it was super blurry, bro. But hey, every now and then occasionally through the like black screen that's like a titty pop out. A titty pop out. And then it's just like, wow, amazing. <laughs> hey, hey, what's up, Swing? How you doing, bro? Uh, bro, I'm more into Chad Pokemon. What is a Chad Pokemon? Spike Pokemon. Oh, no. Nah. Chill, 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 chill. Lots of gold. Good. Yeah, so when, when, you, when you get a better score... Nice work. Uh, click here. <clears throat> Yeah, so when you get a better score, it actually keeps the score of the difference, regardless if you keep the picture. So even if I pick this one, it'll still give me the points for that. And the Crystal Bloom doesn't really matter. Charizard and Blastoise, the manly ones. Oh, okay. Oh, Charizard's so dope. Okay. Yeah, I feel like... What do we need to do? I think I need to do... Oh, they tell me what I need to do anyways. Oh, I remember watching it. Yo, George Lopez was so good. I had the biggest crush on that, um, Carmen. Oh, she was gorgeous, dude. How old was I when George Lopez was a thing? Pokemon is mad at me, so I don't see myself picking this up. That's fair. Uh, after each package, uh, uh... I never did use a Pikachu in my team. Oh, I, dude, I would stay in the Viridian Forest until Pikachu came out. When I found out that Pikachu um, spawned there, I went ballistic, bro. Look at the cute little Eevee. I was hoping that I could get the Sylveon to come out. I think that I need um the Pokey Flute. Oh look at the little Eevee, bro. Imagine taking your Pokemon to a Pokemon Center. What's the bump on the Caterpie's head? And he did some persuasion being caught. <laughs> but like, I mean, y you you say that, right? It's like, huh? It's like, oh, what's this bump on the Pokemon's head? It's like, oh, it got into a battle. You know what I'm saying? It's like, oh, what did it fight? Eh, it got body slammed by a Venusaur. <laughs> And and, and, yo, and and Ash did that, bro. Like he's like, yo, Pikachu, go up against this Onyx. That Pikachu should be fucking dead. Like dead ass, just dead. <laughs> Whoever played as Uncle Jesse made me gay for the duration of me watching that show. Full House was the shit, and Uncle Jesse was hot. You know, it's so funny that you say that, cause um, he has a new show out in Disney Plus. And because of him in Full House, I'm like, I'm like, how do I not watch this show? And my girl's like, is like, oh, who's who's that? And I'm like, he's the really hot guy from Full House. And she's like, what's that? And I'm like, dang, dude, I really am too old for my girlfriend. 
Let's see. Uh, this game looks amazing, but I'm not gonna get it. That's fair, bro. That's fair. I mean, that's why I wanted to stream it, too, because I'm like... The people that are definitely gonna get it are probably gonna pick this game up early. And if, um, I could at least, like, show you guys the game... Hopefully you guys can at least, like, appreciate it. Because I know a lot of people that are gonna skip buying this game to begin with. Just because they don't know what Pokemon Snap's about. They just assume that you don't have any control. You literally just drive by, take a picture. Drive by, take a picture. Drive by, take a picture. Too old for my GF, what do you mean? Oh, bro, you you young, what you mean? <laughs> Alright. Oh, oops, I'm supposed to... Easier if I just do that. Is this a demo? Nah, this is the, this is the game. Let's do this. Pokemon was a good part of my childhood, seeing you playing this brings me good memories. Oh, that's good to hear. Yeah, the, when I found out that this game was coming out, I was like, dang, dude. Pokemon Snap, the original one, only had like 80 Pokemon. So like, seeing this game come out, I was like, dude, if they're gonna come out with more, that's gonna be awesome. It's not my fault, you're a dino. I never said it's your fault. The Pokemon manga had some interesting panels, a cloister froze and then sliced two Magmars in half. What? What does that even mean? Adam out got work early. Ah, right, yo, you have a good night, man. Take care. Appreciate you stopping by. So you're gonna stream, B stream BBS tomorrow? Yeah, pro um, tomorrow I think uh, I'm gonna stream. <clears throat> it's Red Character Day, so I'll be able to use my Spirit Society Biakia. To be honest, I I I, I kind of want to stream BBS today, but like, I kind of want to play this game right now. Oh, I need to get this up. It's funny how Ash is the same age for 20 years, yeah, for real. Yeah, once you start unlocking, like, everything, like, this game becomes a lot more interesting. Oh, you son of a bitch. Look at that, yo. Just fucking ran away. So you gotta get a haircut. I gotta take care. I need to do runs tomorrow for my Ginjo. Bat. Yo, sweet, hit me up. So I'll definitely be able to grind. If anything, I'll stream at like three so that I can finish Senkaimon. I think three hours should be more than enough time. <laughs> it like knocks them over. on the banner tomorrow night probably yeah there's the score bunny Research there too. <laughs> Thanks, honey boo. I'm dead. Just a reminder to hit that like button if you are new. We're 100 subs close to Mr. Beast. Let's try to get Spite to 62 mil. I appreciate it, bro. We're almost there. We're getting there. So slowly but surely. I haven't even finished in Kaimon. Got to stage 30 of the new level, and that's it. 
Oh, this this new Senkai mode is toxic as hell. Um, Cool made a video about how K-Lab lied to us and said that it needed to be delayed, when in reality, the reason that it was delayed wasn't because it wasn't ready, it was because the bonus characters for the later stages weren't even out yet. So characters like Dark Rukia, so you needed a you need a speed Soul Reaper with no affiliation killer. Like that's really scummy to me, in my opinion anyways. This reminds me of Jurassic Park for some reason. Oh, I feel that. Mr. Beast has some controversy. Eh, it's bullshit as usual. It's people just clout chasing. Pokemon Adventures it follows all the game characters like red, blue, green, and yellow. Pokemon Adventures. Oh, that one. Okay. That's the darker version. They better drop characters I like or else my chances of speed Kokuto is down the drain. Oh, they better not. Okay, I was about to say, I'm like, I'm like wait, what? Ah, uh, part of me kind of wants to go for the speed Kokuto also. Because I don't have them. What do they want me to do? Do they want me to do the research camp? Can I do the research camp? I don't know. Kusaka banner is tomorrow night as well, pretty sure. Aw, oh, dude. Oh, here it is. Well, look who it is. Todd. For the person that was asking about Todd. <laughs> they actually put him in the game, bro. I was like, oh damn. He's a professional Pokemon photographer. His work takes him all over the world. It's funny because he has like a fangirl. An old travel companion. He ain't worth it unless he's semi-built. I know, I know. It's just that he's like a movie character, right? And it's like, I already have Rukia, so I, I know that I don't need him. I'll probably toss the first multi, wow, really just in case, because it's like, it's just the first multi. Hey! Huh? Actually, I'm not even going to do that now that I think about it, because if, hey, if I do the first multi, I want to do the first multi on Kusaka and Kokuto. I feel like those will be more important for me. Uh, the fact that movie Ichigo is on uh, freaking Kusaka's, I think it's Kusaka's banner, is okay, really yeah. freaking cool. And I'm so oh, I can't. Well, when does um when do the resurrections come out? You must sacrifice a Bidoof before you move on to the next level. However, and I should be able to move on after this one. And then we'll get an anniversary Renji. Okay. <sighs> I don't know if we'll get it for six anniversary. Maybe like an end of the year. Listen up, team. I'm going. Would be cool if we got like an end of the year, ten years later, Orihime and uh, Renji. That'd be dope. Oh, nice. The next area. Hey, so... Yep. Wow. Mm -hmm. Great. Anyway. I hate that kid. Show me his degree or I ain't believe in Todd. <laughs> or you can waste $23.99 for a pack with more orbs since he's new. They haven't confirmed the, uh, the movie characters to get a pack. Did the movie characters get confirmed to get a pack? I don't believe so. Thanks. I feel like I would have put that in the news. Mm, no. May 12th to 13th should be the res news in the game. Oh, in the game? Like. They won't care that wants people to summon more. But like, it, it, it's more of a, what do you call it? If movie characters get packs, I'll be a broke bitch, bruh. I'm already a broke bitch. I don't know, I just assume they would. I, I assume that they would not. Enjoy your first time on Bella Silva Island. It really is a jungle out there. Keep your eyes peeled and your camera ready for Pokemon. Good luck. Oh, look at the A-bombs.
Oh, that was actually a really good picture. We got a new Renji a little while ago. Yeah, that was um, that was mid one January though. <clears throat> I mean, if, if he comes out for anniversary, it would, it would make it like six months. So, fuck out of the way. Question is who knew to put the track out of this way in particular? I don't think it's actually a track though. Cause if you notice the track is like I guess it is predispositioned. Hmm. It's weird. Got piggy peck in there. He's like, yo, who the fuck was that? So why you gotta go do that? Oh, there's a what do you call it there? Piggy Peck was like, motherfucker, who you think you is? Yeah, for real though. Wake up. See the little parts? What's cool is in the later stuff, like, oh, he's eating it! Yo, look how cute they are, though. Hey, what's up, big boy Joy? Big boy Joe, what's up? Oh my god, that guy dipped faster than Sharky's cat. What the hell was that? Is the animal abuse throwing an apple? <laughs> hey man, we'll just take them to a Pokemon Center if they get too hurt, alright? Better they make Todd older, but Ash is still 10. I don't know how old Todd is actually supposed to be. I expect that we get a premium banner and it'll be either Fierce Battle or more Zompak Toes. I'm actually really happy that they're doing more Zompak Toes. The game is cool, but you really don't get bored. Um... Not really. Not in the later... Not in the later stuff. Eventually, eventually you don't really want to do the missions for the eighth time in a row, the same thing. But like, when you... The thing is, when you unlock level two, the... The missions change up quite a bit. Is only taking pictures as a game, pretty much. A new discovery. I said that we get a premium banner. It'll be either fierce battle or more Zompak So okay, we'll see. We'll see how. Oh, that's a cute one. Oh, that's a three-star pose. That's funny. A new discovery. I would have gotten a better picture if I just like chucked. <laughs> They just like assaulted this little motherfucker in his home, like early. Nice work. In the old Pokemon Snap, you threw something called Pester Balls in here so that you don't look like a total asshole. You still threw apples in the original one, but instead of like feeling like a total dickhead throwing like 
pester balls, which is literally smoke bombs. Dude, what do you call it? Uh, you get these things called Illumina Orbs, which I think you unlock after, uh, during the Illumina stage on this one. Yeah, right now I'm trying to score well enough so that we can level up to two right away and unlock Nighttime quicker and then unlock Illuminas quicker. Hey, Spy, how'd you uh, get into BBS? Um, I was playing Dokkan. I did, was watching a summon video. Uh, happened upon a summon video for two games in Dokkan. Uh, and then uh, and then they had like a showcase on Full Hollow Ichigo, which is really dope. Okay. <clears throat> It'd be cool if you could travel inside a submarine, plane, or rocket. Spoilers. <laughs> so, mood. Okay. Hopefully I can take some decent pictures. Uh, I'll quit out in the middle of this so that way we can unlock level 2. Taking pictures of many Pokemon from different regions. Oh yeah, they, I mean, this is nothing compared to the other regions that come out. I feel like they did a really good job, um, although I'm not gonna, I don't want to spoil anymore. That's why can I catch you in the Safari Zone? You know, the Safari Zone pissed me off so much because I never understood why I can't just, like, physically assault those Pokemon, bro. And, I, I mean, like, I get that the Pokemon, like, there are some Pokemon that beat me up and stuff, like Scyther and Pinsir. But, yo, Kangaskhan can come catch these fucking hands, my guy. Like, I'll, I'll beat the, I'll double punch the Kangaskhan up. I'll get my five hits in. Say goodbye. This little motherfucker in his home, bro. That, yeah, fuck you. Get your ass out here. Yeah, fuck you too. <laughs> yeah, he's, yeah he's, he's legit mad, bro. Hey, what you gonna do about it? Yeah, fuck you. Okay. It's not gonna shove you inside or punch. I'll hit that motherfucker with a comet punch, bro. Yo, those, those Kangaskhans were level 16, alright? I kicked them. Nah, you could in the game, you could throw the rocks. I don't I don't remember the throwing rocks, dude. That sounds hella rude. You had the flutes, you had the pester balls, you had the the apples. I'm trying to remember rocks. Was it rocks and not apples? Oh, that'd be mean. We just need a little Kenny. Oh, dude! You know that we have young Kenny's, like, files in the game, right? Like, we have him when he was, uh, fighting Unahana the first time. Good. I wanted you to knock him off the tree branch. I don't think they let you actually like hurt the Pokemon like that. There's some stuff that you could do that's actually mad sus. Like, you can make two Pokemon like fight each other, but like I don't wanna. All right. I'd rather you guys like see that than um, just me tell you about it. What? What? Huh? Oh, 
um, yeah. Mm-hmm. That bird be like, hey, bro, what up? <laughs> Thanks. Safari gave you bait, rocks, and balls. Oh, the Pokemon game. I thought you meant um the original Pokemon Snap. You had rocks. Or are you saying that? I forget. Oh. At least his apples are not rocks. Like the original Pokemon Safari. Yeah, the rocks was fucked up. Like, I want to know who okayed that for the first red and blue. Like, it's like, Watashi wa rock this. Just like, fuck. <sighs> you, you actually gonna give, like, people concussions, dude? You remember how annoying it was to try to catch a Dratini? It's like, you have to catch, you have to go to specific spots in the Safari Zone. Might have a hard time finding Pokemon. Look for a glowing crystal bloom for me, would you? I'm like, how many does it take to actually knock him off? Because I... I, <laughs> I remember that you could knock him off, but I, I don't remember it being like... <laughs> Mama said, knock you out. Damn more lols, bro. They better make Lil Kenny broken. Oh, he better be. They better not be like Kid Biakia. Alright, they have Ledians. Can I knock you off? I don't know if I can knock him off. <laughs> Are you mad, bro? Get the fuck out of here. Man, this is dead asleep. He even farted. What? Did he? That's interesting that now he's not in his nest asleep. What's flying? Oh, the two cannons. Okay. That's cute. Waiting for a Vaporeon. <laughs> What's my favorite evolution? It's probably between... It's between Espeon and Jolteon. 100%.
There we go. Much better. Oh, you have a picture limit? Uh, I think you get, yeah, you have a 72 picture limit. Uh, every run. <laughs> Just like knock them out. The Apollyon used to be my favorite, but I just, I, I really, really like Lightning. Missed opportunity to try to throw an apple in the mouth of that Quagsire. That's actually a good idea. I don't think that they would let me. Welcome back. It's possible. It's possible. Jungle Knight Evaluation. All right. What? How did you pick this picture? There are so many good pictures. I should have just went with my gut and just like reviewed what it was being picked. Oh, that's actually a good picture. That better be a rainbow uh, platinum. Yeah, that's good. Idiot ten year old trampled by a Taurus rocks were to Yo Taurus were annoying to pick up too. What, what was the what did um What were the point of rocks in the red version? Like red and blue. Like I to this day I don't remember what if there was even a point to throwing rocks. Cause it just pissed the Pokemon off. I felt like it actually made everything worse. Great timing. I don't even remember what treats did. The rocks kept them from running away? And, and what did the treats do? Oh, what's up, Remy? How you doing? I just I just recognized the name. I hope you've been well, bro. Calm them down to catch. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, I don't remember all too well. Nice. Just to make them mad. <laughs> you just piss them off, right? Like, imagine someone, like... Imagine you're getting into an argument, right? And they're about, you're about to walk away, and then they just throw a bunch of rocks at you. Yep. <laughs> like hit you, hit you in the head with like a big rock, and knock you unconscious. Oh, it's like okay, at least you can't run oh. away now. Mm -hmm. huh? now then. Oh, nice. So we're finally unlocking Illumina orbs, which um is pretty much the <laughs> pester balls of uh. These are pretty much the pester balls of Pokemon Snap, uh, the new Pokemon Snap. I think they just look in the streams cage. I feel that. Mm -hmm. hey, so yep. <laughs> the Illumina orbs. So the Illumina orbs actually unlock a, a few hey, so like pretty good things. I bet Illumina orbs will help us find new stuff. Yeah. Okay. What happens if you throw a Pokeball to a human? I don't think anything happens, to be honest. But it would be interesting, like, how does it know that it's a Pokemon that you're throwing a thing to, right? Oh, I didn't even know that he did that. Bitch, turn around. Right in the cooler, okay.
Oh, I've never seen that. I've never seen an Umdumoga do that before. Oh, that's cute. Have, a, have an apple. What? I'm so mad. That's my first time actually ever seeing that. The Swanas have a cute animation, I think. And they don't. I remember them having an animation on the way. Magikarp is the weakest Pokemon. I'm kind of sad because I was really hoping that you could evolve one of these Magikarps to Gyarados. I feel like that was a missed opportunity of nostalgia. Um, but back in the day, you used to be able to like hit, hit the Magikarp multiple times until he fell into the vortex, like the whirlpool, and then he would actually evolve, which was pretty fucking cool. Yeah, fuck you. What do you want to do? Yeah, I'm not from this way, fine. used to catch one and put XP share on it since he's weak. I was so happy when they made XP share for the whole party. Some people didn't like it, but I'm like, I'm not trying to waste any time grinding XP. Oh, that's a good picture of Comfy. I didn't even know that Comfy's had a face. Low-key comfies are trashed here. <laughs> oh, she was waving, bro. She wanted it, dude. There's a weird combo to try and catch them, Toros, Chansey. They were so annoying. Yeah, they were definitely hella annoying. And the Magikarp was dry. That Magikarp dies, bro. Someone explained that Pokeballs have their own space inside like a little house. Yeah. But like, to throw one at a human is interesting. Because like, I always question that too, like, how would that work? That's the four star one. Oh, that's a better. Good. Upgraded photo. Oh, that's the four star version? Okay. I didn't. I don't think I got that in the. even in my own game. I don't remember seeing that at all. Oh, the duck ones are cute as hell. Hey, what's up, Alex? How you doing? I hope you've been well, bro. Nice. Yeah, that comfy pick was really good. If that levels me up to three, that'd be freaking great. I can show you some cool stuff. Perfect. All right, cool. So part level three. I don't know what happens at research level max. After three, there's it just goes to max. So I don't know exactly what the difference is. Throw them hot gym leaders that are female, and you could have your own harem. Oh, Cynthia. Yo, Cynthia's OP wife, OG wife. Oh, Whitney. Oh my God, Whitney was so hot when I was like ten years old. <laughs> you probably clarify. That's good. I like that.
Oh sh damn I'm old is scare the shit out of me sometimes. This should be close enough to trigger the Amoga flying in. See, that's the, like the thing I like about this game is like there's certain things that you have to unlock in the nighttime that unlock something in the daytime. Also, it is in the max. Okay, cool. I was gonna say that as a child, sir. Uh, dude, I was like eight. I was like ten years old. All right. She's like that sexy nanny that like you low key want to smash, but like. You don't want her to stop being your nanny. That was actually a really good one. They reveal the whereabouts of Ash's father. Ash doesn't have a father. But besides that, everything is all right. You're a good man. I'm chilling, man. I wonder how they'll top the dancing Charmanders from the volcano level in the original Snap. How could they top it? I'm trying to think if there's a place that they definitely top it. I, I just the only thing that I really wish is that I wish that you leveled up a lot quicker in this game than you norm than you actually do. Cause like if I could just get this to like level four, I don't know if it's only level four or if I have to do something in the nighttime. I'm pretty sure I just have to level up to four. Uh, I'm fucking sure Professor Oak is the father. Oh, that Professor Oak definitely, definitely clap, bro. Have you seen how much it costs for like a cat or a dog? If you're like, like, you're like no one adopts a kitten unless like they're having a baby. And those Pokemon that Professor Oak was were, were given away, he worked for those Pokemon. Those Pokemon don't naturally show up in the wild. So for him to give those away, you know he was clapping some pancake some parents' pancakes, bro. Great timing. Great timing. Nice work. Nice work. And Ash's mom was a fucking thought, bro. You know damn well she was getting her pancakes smashed by that Mr. Mime. She's like, finally a man that listens to me. Splash was only useful against Tentacle. That is not true. 
I let my magic card run out of splash so you could use struggle. You know struggle has a 100% hit rate? So you don't have to worry about missing if you use struggle. was my chance he'd be like Ash the very best Pokemon trainer since he'd be watching his mom for a long time. He's like you got this covered sweetie. Just get your precious like doodoo -doo slap. No, you. Magic cars just like lying there. hurt itself yeah um some people who do like really like really challenging stuff what they'll do is what they'll uh it's got a half decent picture of that what, was that? what is that huh. yeah this is the best between yeah this girl does a backflip Sylveon was sleeping next to him. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, so when the, whenever the people were doing like really hard content, if they wanted to like guarantee that they would hit in case they have like a 70% chance miss rate or whatever, some people would literally use struggle and like time 
how much damage they can eat before they would lose. It's, re it's really cool. Really, really, really cool. Like, I think somebody did a, a can you beat the game with a Magikarp <laughs> or something like that. Oh, that's a good one. Nice. Great timing. Yeah, it's definitely. Nice work. Great timing. Great timing. Nice work. Nice work. Oh, look at that. Nice work. Nice work. A new discovery. Perfect timing. Oh, that's a rainbow pick. Fucking perfect. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think of what to do. I could. Yeah, we'll do the jungle. With the Illumina orbs now, that should change that up quite a bit, too. I think I forgot to try to get it to level 2. <laughs> what an awesome tree, I'm dead. Sometimes I get scared that I'll get killed in this game. <laughs> Bro, it's 5.18 a.m. I'm not sleeping because of this shit. Bro, go to sleep, man.
I'm not even quite sure what that one does. Is he cleaning himself? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, no, you can't throw it in his mouth. Okay. W streamers, appreciate that, Tristan. How you doing, man? It's time. I low-key want to Google Ash's father now. There we go. Yeah, usually when you get those stuff to level 2, you unlock like the next thing. <laughs> Alright, on to the next site. Twitch decide because, like, Twitch, I can do polls. Switch poll. Hi. Actually, what? Ah, oh, the melody player? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Oh, Rita. Yep, excuse me. Let me see if I can do this now. Cause like I didn't know about this until like super super late in the game. to beat the game before you can actually do it. Feels bad. But yeah, there there's Leafy on over there.
<clears throat> oh, okay, so it's after you beat the main campaign. Oh, that's sad. Yeah, um, you actually unlock Mew in that, uh, what do you call it? In that specific area. Yeah, so every single one of these places actually has their own legendary Pokemon. So there's like a bunch of legendary Pokemons in this game. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna do a poll. So do you guys wanna do the water stage or the volcano stage first? No, I guess it's not really the volcano stage, I guess it's more of the desert. Desert versus the beach. Yeah, it's desert versus the beach. water I'm, I'm, it's it's the beach area so this is the sweltering sands versus uh, the blushing beach the desert winds the desert because of the meteorite the meteorite sand sand and more sand seems like a gritty environment Pokemon live differently here than on the other islands. Stupid, bro. I'm just fucking barrel roll. I need to unlock the Illumina balls. So the Illumina, um, Crystal Blooms, to get the Illumina balls, you need to take a picture of the... Aw, oh, damn it, that would have been such a good photo op. You need to get a picture of the lit up Crystal Bloom, which only takes place at night. Oh, that could have been a good one, too. Look at the hit... Bro, that's a fast hippo! Oh, yeah, hippos are supposed to be fast, huh? I like how you didn't even really eat it.
Seen a video on this stage at nighttime where the meteorite crashes down and some monsters get yeeted. Yep. Damn, I missed whatever that was. I, to be fair, I didn't actually explore this stage all that much. So, I, I know some of the mons that show up here. Yeah, like the trap hinge down here. Did he just like assert his dominance? Yeah, why does he have his eyes closed, dude? He was moving, moving. <laughs> yeah, he, he was sprinting, bro. If you see a hippo chasing your ass, just like pray. Just Hello. try to enjoy a swift death. Just so I put like the Persona soundtrack. Oh no, I can't do that because you won't even be able to hear the Persona soundtrack because that's right. Nice work. Oh, that actually ended up being a really good pick. That's awesome. That's a cute one. I like that. Yeah, that's rainbow. If that's platinum, i would be fine. Anyway. <sighs> but it's not platinum. It hurts. That's silver. <laughs> When you think that it's a good picture and then they tell you that it's fucking dog shit? You know when you give birth to your baby and the doctor's like, What a gorgeous, precious baby. Imagine if the doctor tells you like, Wow. That baby looks like fucking trash. Good. Oh, I'm so glad that Fubo went up today. I actually need to read their earnings report. I heard that it was really good. Food Fubo delivered a record $120 million in revenue, grew total subscribers to 590k in Q1 2021, increased 2021 guidance. It's awesome. Yeah, Fubo went up by like 30% today, which is good because I'm still down on that position despite it going up by so much. It, it fucking plummeted. Though I don't think that it, it, pl it necessarily plummeted because of good reasons. I think that the shorts are just like trying to have their way with it, which is annoying. Uh, deliver delivering better than expected growth in subscribers, up 105% year over year, including 43,000 net additions in the quarter. Uh, total revenue is up 135% year over year, advertising revenue is up 206% over a year over year. I suppose the sky is clearer at night than during the day. I'll let him fight for it. Oh, there's a Kangaskhan. Fuck you. I'm gonna double trouble your mom. Oh 
when we close the earnings report. Yep. Well, there goes the meteorite. I need to get a hold of the crystal blooms. Had so many friends buying Doge before Musk, thinking it would get to one dollar by then. Oh damn, that's a mood. Yeah, I picked up Doge. I um, what's his face? Uh, Kabuki hit me up about Doge with uh, Elon Musk and stuff when it was like thirty cents, and I'm like, I bet I'll do that. I saw the N64 one. Me too, baby. Me too. How you doing, Bardock? Wait, what? I've never seen that before. Fuck you. I didn't know that he could do- that's actually really cool. Look at this, this is funny. What? Accept my love. So unmotivated, bro. Oh, there's the Kangaskhan. Gucci. Do you see Safe Moon or Shiba? I might jump in. Oh, I want to get into Shiba, but I can't buy crypto here, bro. Fucking New York sucks dick, dude. You're not allowed to buy, you're not allowed to use the crypto exchanges if you're from New York. Just dog shit, bro. Absolute fucking dog shit. But you know how I'm buying uh, XRP? I'm, 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 I'm sending Rawad 150 bucks, and I'm sending Kabuki 300 bucks. <laughs> so, so that they could buy XRP for me and then send it to my Bitcoin wallet. Well, my crypto wallet. something house would say what would he say midnight form best form yo big facts gate.io is what i was told was best it's illegal for them to allow me as a new yorker to do it and since you have to sign up and get pre-approved if you lie on your form they can restrict your account and then you just lose your entire like crypto wallet which is fucking bullshit too so it's, it's really fucking annoying do a backflip? I can't do no backflip, bro. Hello. Ugh. It's just an. I need to get out of New York, bro. Fuck New York. All right. Mm, nice work. Mm, great timing. Really? That was the picture that they went with. Though. A new discovery. Great timing. Good. Time to move. I know, bro. A new discovery. I'm trying to move to Florida. Nice work. Nice work. A new discovery. Nice work. Nice work. A new discovery. Nice work. Move to Nebraska. I'm probably gonna move to Florida, to be honest. A new discovery. Te yeah, Florida or Texas. Texas seems pretty good, but like Florida, 
I wouldn't have to pay as much taxes at all. And I, I'm not gonna lie, I have more people in- we have more people together in Florida than we would in, in New York. Because you have family in Florida too? Or do you have family in Texas? Because you know I have family in Florida. And then we have Pun and Naku too. For now. I don't know if they're planning to move out. Because Pun getting married. And Texas is good as long as you don't get a winter storm. Yeah, they need to fix their infrastructure for the electricity, but that's gonna be every state, bro. Because all the the entire power grid for every state is at the point where it's failing, and it'll cost a lot of money to to actually renovate it and fix it. So they usually wait until it fucking just just gets just, until it just doesn't work no more. And that's what happened in Texas. It just actually went complete total failure. Right. Okay. Put an actor that moving. Oh, really? They're moving out, out, out of Florida? Really? stop that hurricane. Tornado or not hurricane. Hey, what's up, Olu? How you doing? Well, I know that they're moving out of, like, their house, but, like... I don't know many people that actually want to move out of Florida in particular. Fucking Tyranitar. That motherfucker's sleeping, bro.
Oh! I never saw that one. Damn. Throw apples at the Pokemon when the music pops up for different animations. Throw apples at the Pokemon when the music pops up? Welcome back. When the music pops up. What do you mean by that? Squirrel be flying the tornado is the funniest thing. If you go to Texas, you would be next door. Yeah, but I gotta figure out like a nice place in Texas too. My mom like read that there's a lot of crime, like crime rates going up in a place called Amarillo, and she was looking around Amarillo. God, that torture is so adorable. Like smack the fuck out of him with an apple. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I should, I should start doing that more. Yes. Just come suffer in this dry heat. <laughs> That's the whole mood. I haven't seen anything on Arizona. But I gotta figure out a place that would be good for my girlfriend and myself. Right. And it's just like Orlando just seems kind of like Come on. Orla Orlando's pretty like cheap. The houses, the housing, like housing's pretty inexpensive in comparison to like other states, especially New York. And like, I'll be able to do YouTube there as well as uh, as well as like a bunch of other stuff. I almost hit 100 yesterday. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, we would be neighbors with Daphne. That's Arizona. Oh, look at the Altaria. Do I have the Illumina Balls here? I do. The Lux Rays look so cool. Yeah, what you gonna do about it, huh? What you gonna, yeah, nothing. Fuck you. Luxray is doing in a volcano like I, I don't understand like the logic is flawed <laughs> how's the game so far oh, I've beaten this game digital I just wanted to I restarted it because I'm like I mean like, I feel like this would be a cool game like a cool chill game to just stream They're like, oh hell nah. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Those fucking jokes. There's a cave here. Live in Florida or Alabama for the me. I'm not living in Alabama, bro. I'm on Furnos, cool. Are you just doing flips off the wall, bro? Go 
Go kill yourself. Did he actually fall in lava though? I feel like he might have actually fallen in lava. So who was talking about the dancing Charmanders? that do? <laughs> if you poke, you flew. Yeah, they still have the Charmanders. They have the Mews. I'm just sad because I, I apparently you unlock the legendary Pokemons oh. to show up after you beat the uh, main story. Just pull Potion Keyscape back to back from two five star tickets, the event five star, and the birthday. Good for you, bro. Shit. Oh, that got him five five. Oh, he's gonna be a savage, dude. That's why do you not hear the little music box thingy from your headphones? Music box thingies? Nice work. You mean like the pokey flute? Or like an actual like music thing? A new discovery. Nice work. You talking about the pokey flute? A new discovery. Perfect timing. They have all the legendaries? Nah, they don't have all the legendaries, but they have a good bit of them. Nice work. I kinda wish I didn't delete my save now. Oh, uh, you know what? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Actually, I might be able to re-download my save. Save data cloud. Download save data. Let me see if, if I have my save data. No, I didn't save the save data because the fucking save data for Pokemon Snap is 500 megabytes, which is more than you can actually even back up, which I think is stupid. Um, ready to start system update. Start software. No, we're not going to do that. Damn, I hope they didn't just delete all those pictures I took from the fucking volcano. I'll be tight. Nice out of five. LMAO, weird but great. Oh man, it, dude, five out of five Kiske is amazing, bro. Thanks. Damn it. Thanks. Ah, oh, they fucking making me do it. God damn it. I was hoping that I could. I, I thought that I might have backed up my save data, but I forgot. Since it's 500 megabytes, I don't know if um, you even get enough. I don't even think you get enough. I don't think you get that much space. I'm gonna do like a set it and forget it to back up from now on, and hopefully it backs up eventually. But like, I'm pretty sure that that they don't let you. Bonk?
Yeah, so this is a Pokey Flute. I, I can turn it off and on. I guess it's because, like... Transform flip horizontal. I can move myself here. So that way you can actually like see. See like the pokey flute. The fact that they're so demotivated they just run away is gold. I'm sad that when I got back, um, the times five runs were over. Oh no, time times five. I I'll say that when I came back from Ohio, uh, the potion, the double potions, they finished the, the stupid event. And I was like, ah, oh, I could have farmed so many potions. I waited one day because I wanted to farm with Momo, like get my Momo carries in, you know? self-destruct. <laughs> <There he is. laughs> it just feels bad. It feels evil, bro. Yo, did he not? Yo, he didn't come back up. Oh, there he is. It would have been cool if you could evolve him. I don't think that they kept the evolve mechanic. You remember how you could like throw Charmeleon into the lava and then he'll evolve into Charizard? That would have been cool, but I don't think that they they kept that in there. And that didn't really do much. They only self-destruct if you find a random sh I believe that at some point I found a shiny graveler. And I want to I I don't remember if I caught it or not. I want to say that I caught it wow. only because I feel like I would have definitely remembered if it killed itself. I was about to say that with getting the Charmeleon evolve into the Charizard with the lava. Yeah, that would have been dope. It's possible they have something like that somewhere, though. Because I know that they have some crazy, weird mechanics that you can do to unlock different things. 
Nice, got a good picture there. Nice picture of Aerodactyl's cool. Nice work. I'm hungry, bro. A new discovery. Great timing. A new discovery. But me and Sharky are fasting. I had a slice of cheese and a cup of water and a cup of orange juice. A new discovery. Fresh squeezed orange juice from the actual orange, not uh, Tropicana. A new discovery. Nice work. A new discovery. Perfect timing. Nice, we actually got the level two right away. That's fucking awesome. All right. Oh, the fucking sheets. Oh, right, I only did this stage once. Shinx. Shinx! Stop! Shinx. Fuck! I have him sleeping. Hey, what's up, Kerwin? How you doing? Shit. That actually scared I know that they can't hurt me and I still get scared. that noise sounds like two Charmanders are getting it let me move uh, the camera a little bit oh, there we go oh, this man's sleeping now
Oh, there's two Tyrantrums sleeping? Oh, hell no. <laughs> I don't want to get this place level 3. This place is really cool. Sounds like Karen's talking. <laughs> Yappity yap. Alum. Who's Alum? I think that's Nerd Era. Die. Oh, what the fuck? The professor says he's picking up a weird reading from in there. Well, I mean, he didn't die. So I guess he can't be too mad at me. The Shinx is so cute. Explosions, bro. Oh, just one. Oh, there's the other one. I was so happy when I saw the Typhlosion. I wigged out. Oh, you can make him fire? I actually didn't know that you can make them with their fire command. That's cool. Man, it's puffed up, yes sir. I'll check this for a little while. <laughs> this is someone messaged me because I'm going to do a showcase on, um, on uh, well, what is the account? Ah, uh, yeah, I was going to do a showcase on, well, I'm going to do a showcase on Machine Society Namu. That's Max Transcendent 2020, and uh, he's like, do step 15, try to get Orihime, because everyone in my guild has their 4 out of 5, but the game refuses to give me the one character I want from that banner. <laughs> I was like, you're doing the tower? Oh, okay. How are you, how are you liking the tower? You, like, is it good? I've heard bad things. Like, I understand the Rukia being a bonus. I think that's bullshit. I actually really don't like that they did that. Great timing. Work. A new discovery. Great timing. Perfect timing. A new discovery. Nice work.
Damn, we actually got a lot of points there. Alright, I'm gonna do the beach one for the, the last run. And then I think I'm gonna call it, just because it is 11, and I do want to get some sleep at a reasonable time. I like sleep, and then I wake up, do the news if there's news, and then go back to sleep. At least that's, that's what I'm trying to do, that way I get like a reasonable amount of sleep. Tower isn't bad, but one floor will get people. Which floor? All oh, right, we have the Illumina Pokemon. Had to use a fully transcended Koga. Damn. <laughs> who's like the actual main? Like, like who? Who's it supposed to be for? Now, don't tell me that you needed to use a fully transcendent Koga, and Koga is the actual main unit that you should be using. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. It couldn't possibly be in all that lava, could it? It's like a massive vibrator. The new soda. Oh, the soda is sure Yuki. Oh my! Jubal Corona. Yeah, I hear Soda and Ru Dark Ru the new Dark Rook get out of stage, which is so stupid. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to postpone the new tower for a month. Kind of fucked up and didn't realize that the characters aren't out yet, so... Uh, you have to like hit him with apples until like it's so annoying. Floor forty eight is first battle on the Tora. They already have a oh I mean I guess that makes sense. That's annoying. I mean, I, I guess at least Sode and what's her face and what's his face Noitora are premium units, right? So I don't think that that's like the worst thing ever. But like Rookie is a fucking brand new movie character. I understand if it's an extra stage, fine. Let the extra stages be for the new characters. But quit being such fucking dirtbags. Where are you? Oh, you son of a bitch. This takes so much.
floor 48 is AIDS, to be honest. Uh, that's sad to hear. I have all, the, like, what seems to be the characters. You don't need any of the characters to beat the stages. Well, I mean, I'm not thinking for myself. I'm thinking more for, like, new players. Like, my, I, I have a fuck ton of max transcendent units. I'm sure I could, like, fucking YOLO and just use Tokinata. Fuck. Stop. Thank you. Oh, now you run away, though. When I finally get you? Go suck your mother. Tokyo is all 35 stages besides the locket and lol. Seems like the way to go, right? I guess that's it for now. I ain't gonna stress over 10 orbs this ain't 2018, I feel that. Floor 48 is a spot out only, which I do 100. Oh, that's good. Jeez. So it has two floors. There's a floor for first battle, Sile, but not too bad. What is Sile? Is he is he Quincy Killer? He's like one of the he's like the second Quincy Killer. No, he's the first Quincy Killer. I forget. First Battle Style and Soda are the two Quincy Killer. Okay, so there's two. I get confused if there's two or three because, like, I have pulled so uh, Style from Rave Soul tickets. So I have, like, a weird sense of. I didn't pull the Quincy Killer on his banner. I pulled him much later on. There's a floor for Ginjo. Oh. They made a stage for Ginjo? Boss stage for Camp Your Own World Suki. Oh, well, I mean, I get that's a given, bro. Alright, boys, we're gonna call it a night here because I do want to get some sleep at some right at a regular time. Uh, I will be streaming BBS tomorrow, so that way we can do some Kaimon. We can see how toxic that is for my account. I don't think it should be that bad because I do have the characters. And, um,. I'll probably play some Pokemon Snap sometime uh, in a couple days. That way we can do like the other maps and stuff like that. I don't know if uh, maybe I'll like replay it again off camera and then uh, just have like the new map, like have all the maps so that people can actually like play. How's the game though? Oh, I love this game. This game is like super nostalgic for me though. Though I can definitely see why people might get bored of it. Um, but like since I'm playing it and stuff like that, I, I really do enjoy it and I think that the scenery of it is really, really cool. Alright boys, y'all have a good night, I appreciate y'all coming out, thank you guys so much for all the support, y'all have a blessed day, I'll see y'all, I'll see y'all tomorrow if y'all come through. <laughs> make sure to go hug your moms, make sure to hug your dads, let them know that you love them, alright, peace out y'all, BBS news tomorrow, not the banner news, but tonight we'll probably get some, we'll probably get the news that uh, the compensation's five orbs for Geno and OP Wild and the ability to continue wailing on the game and, and hoping that they don't get banned again. And then uh, we should get to banner info, not tonight, tomorrow night. Alright, so in like, in like 27 to 30 hours. Alright, have a good night. Take care, y'all. See y'all in the next one. Peace.